Hello and welcome to Farming Simulator 2015 with me Kevin Sawyer and today you join me as I plant my seeds for the sunflower you meet me br bright and early on my farm a farmer's life is never a happy one we pretty much uh, have to get up pretty early in the morning to start our uh, jobs of the day so you know today is going to be a busy day for us start seeding up and everything and uh, today what I'm going to do is talk about some things uh, off topic so to speak sorry about the lag everyone again you know if I could uh, I'm saving up towards a better graphics card and hopefully that's going to resolve a lot of these issues um, you know if uh, anyone's listening like NVIDIA or any of the other famous graphics card people um, and you fancy uh, or, or you'd like to uh, me to uh, do a product review on your graphics card then I'll be more than happy to do that you know just let me know either PM me or get in contact with me somehow and uh, I'll be very happy to do that for you. It's unlikely though, um, so it's a case of continuing to save the pennies up together. Get a better one. Alright, let's find some flower seeds. There they are. So let's get them up and running. Off you go, man. We're. Uh, get him up on the top field yeah I'm running a uh, GTX 570 um, so if you can uh, sort of like give me one that's a lot better aspect than that then I'll be more than happy to review it basically after talking to my friend last night here know who it is he's a subscriber and he's a good friend of mine uh, I'm not going to mention his name um, purely because uh, he knows who he is so he knows the conversation we had but he was saying about the uh, my headset issues um, after watching the, all but pretty much all my videos he's uh, saying that one I'm running at the moment which is the old trust one I was talking about is a lot better than the newer one that I have was probably like double the money I paid for this old this old uh, bit of uh, manure so to speak so again it's another case of saving some pennies up and uh, getting a better headset for the time being I'm gonna sort of like grin and bear the fact that it's like crucifying my ears downside of having range finders or glasses as some people <laughs> call them um, it sort of like clips in around them and it pushes both the glasses into the side of your head and it sort of eat nibbles at my ears at the same time this is not an ideal situation when you're trying to do a commentary play on any game or anything at all but it for sound purposes it's a lot better than the crackling aspect and I'm willing to put up for it until I we'll get a be better one anyway. Another thing I was going to talk about today was gold. Not I don't mean as in the beautiful stuff that's nice and shiny and expensive. Um, Farm and Simulator Gold Edition is something I do plan on bringing on uh, to the uh, to my gameplay and I will get the DLC when it comes out I don't actually know when it's due out I'll be honest um, it's a case of uh, I think it's the end of October roughly um, but it's going to be quite expensive DLC from what I have understand it's going to be around about the 15 16 quid mark I haven't actually looked into it as yet, um, but for DLC, it's quite expensive, especially when you've paid it out, what, like 20, 30 quid for the base game itself, 
and then got the other DLCs like the Isle Runner and the uh, New Holland stuff as well. Well, I think the New Holland was free. Right, anyway. Is there anything else I can get up to while we're, d while, while we're doing that? In fact, there's plenty we can get up to. First of all, let's go and see our chickens. Sorry about the lag again. Throw them in. Go into the old chicken hutch. Collect some eggs. The chickens have been busy, haven't you? How are you doing for water? Let's have a look at our stats quickly. Okay, those guys are doing quite well. Gone the wrong way. Uh, yep, yeah, they're doing quite well. The prop that. Excuse me. Your productivity is going to be zero because I've only started the game. Should pick up literally within the next minute or two. Um. Yeah, again they're doing quite well. They've got pretty much everything they need. There's my ch animals page. There we go. Uh, chickens. Again. Okay. Looks like they could do with some more wheat. All right, we're gonna have to go and get some food for them. So that's the next thing on the list. Oh yeah, trough is empty, isn't it? Sorry, chickies. Let's uh, sort that out right now. Yeah, he's going great guns in the sewn aspect. I don't really like the case. In fact, I'm going to exchange that case at some point. I don't know what it is about the case I don't like. I just don't like it. I only bought it because it was before I started doing mods and uploads to the uh, my gameplay it was the most powerful tractor in the game other than the uh, pivot steers which I didn't really get along with right, let's use these smaller trailers I think that's probably there would help if us in the right way Kev, wouldn't it? Normally I park them that way around. Oh well. Yeah so, big thank you to my friend for sort of like having an matter to me about some ideas. We uh, really touched base on how I can uh, sort of like expand the channel a bit more and some little ideas and batted back and forth. One other thing I'm going to ask you guys, and um, you know, and I want you to be honest with me, I, you know, is uh, playtime. Now, is, you know, would you be willing to watch longer videos? At the moment, I'll try and set them for around about the half an hour mark. So, um, one, it's a bit better for me for sort of rendering and editing purposes. Uh, two, and uploading, obviously. Two, I don't want you guys to sort of start nodding off after about half, well, after about 30 minutes or so, and getting bored and then just going away of it from it. Um, so you know, let me know in the comments below. And also, you know, if you if you've seen some, you know, discounts on some good graphics cards, again, let me know down below, and I'll uh, look into them. Right, what do we need? Uh, we we'll use the wheat.
Some more wheat, please. Probably don't need this much, to be fair. What I might do is whatever I've got left over, I'll take it up to the uh, the fertilizer and the seed plant and let, well, let that do its funky thing. I know it was uh, empty when I last looked. Or I might even take it down to the uh, windmill. I'm hoping these guys don't take a lot to a... Uh, I'd say they're more or less full. Right, okay. Let's uh, put up the chicken thing again. There we go. Right, so what I'm going to do, I'll take one trailer load, or what's left in this trailer load, down to the uh, windmill and the other trailer load up to the fertilizer and seed preparation thing. I could just dump it back in my silos but um, I do need to sort of like start thinking about whoa going too quick again Kev lead foot Kev put the old them on lights on, it is still dark To look where I'm going, really. I have gambled. Um, also, I off screen, I sort of like uh, filled up the uh, greenhouses and the lettuce greenhouse as well is up and not running at the moment. In fact, I need to probably go and have a look because I haven't checked it recently to see if the uh, pallet needs emptying off. So I'll probably do that while, once we've done this. But I actually now know the uh, name of this mod, which is the... Uh, which, uh, what was it? Uh, production and Sale mod. It's in my... Um, my Volkshome mod showcase... Um, playthrough the link for that is on there so uh, by all means please go and have a look at that and uh, download it if I can remember I will try and put it back on this uh, playthrough but I probably will forget so forgive me in advance oh, what am I doing Right, almost emptied both the trailers out there Autopilot was engaged there, just not, wasn't even thinking. So we'll take this up to the uh, what's left in this one up to the, uh, the fertilization plant. Get back in there. Whoa! Oh dear. My insurance premiums have just gone up yet again. Go and see our friend at the uh, tractor driving school. He's going to laugh at me yet again and go, You numpty, right? Let's retake your test. Look where you're going. Stage one. Yeah, that's, you know, a good, good idea, Kev, to look where you're going. Don't switch between the cab while you're moving around on a road. Again, that's another, another good idea. Come on, old girl. Let's get up the old hill here. So how are you guys doing anyway? I hope you're all having a good day. Yes, I hear you screaming up back at the screen at me. Well, so we'll top this up. Where is it? Over here, that's it.
I mean, one of these days I will learn how to drive a tractor. Whoa! That was a, that was a tight squeeze there. Right, that's empty, so that's not going to unload. This one will. It's only going to be 22%, but it's better than nothing. Anyway, we're all up this end. I'll just quickly jump out of this. And go over to the old forklift and uh, take off that pallet of uh, lettuce that's there. Off screen, I kind of sort of emptied out the uh, lettuce warehouse. And so it made some room for this. I sold it all on. Gave me some more extra money. In fact, that's another thing I can do this morning. Which is uh, sell off my milk. I expect there's probably quite a fair bit of milk in there. Well, as soon as I've done this, I'll uh, set up the uh, course play for the uh, milk selling aspect again. I'll try Whoa! Power sliding. Again, lead foot, Kev. Lead foot. Don't go so quick. Mind you, the, uh, the controllability on this mod isn't particularly great, but yeah, if you're going sort of like over 10 miles an hour in a forklift truck, it's gonna, it's not gonna forgive you. Right, let's get in the, this view. Way, really? You're gonna do this? You're gonna be like this? Whoops! It does that every now and again. It glitches out and it becomes like a lead weight. So we'll dump this over in the old. should start up within the next minute or so. So let's see check up on the other guys, see how they're doing. Yeah, he's uh, more or less going good guns. Oh he's done. Right, let's move him over to the other field. As you can see the old tractors are nice and clean. Actually I shouldn't really drive over my field now, I've just uh, harvested it. Oh, sorry, harvested it. Now I've just planted it. I don't want to destroy any of the seeds that I've just put in there, so in real life you wouldn't drive over it, so we'll go the long way around. Yeah, so w with aspects of going back to the uh, playtime, so to speak, um, you know, what sort of time would you guys be happy with me uploading? You know, I thought about roughly about 45 minutes mark, maybe an hour. I'd, you know, if I was going to extend it that much, probably that's the two time sets I was going to put in. I was going to put any more than a hours worth of time play because that would take a long time to uh, do the editing and rendering side of it and the uploading probably take me days rather than uh, hours sorry about the lag people it's a work in progress Right, I'm going to try and drive a bit more sensibly. I know it's lagging, so it's one thing that I 
got to take into consideration when I get to this corner because as soon as I get to this corner it stops the lag just goes right that's it I'm done doing what I needed to do whatever I was doing at that point now I'm not going to lag out anymore it suddenly jumps from like walking through quicksand to warp speed Set you up. Oh, indicator still on. Unfold you. I've only got two cedars of this type. I don't want to get too many cedars on the farm. As it is, I've got like four or five different cedars. And I could do a lot of this work off screen, like I was saying, you know. Stuff that you, if you let me know what sort of stuff you want me to do on and off screen as well in the comments. If you want to see a bit more of this side of it as well as the harvest side of it, again, please let me know. Or if you're quite happy with the way I'm doing it at the moment with the, uh, just cut in between a lot of the uh, activities on the farm, then again, please let me know. In fact, what we're doing... We'll have a look, while well, we've got a minute again, we'll have a quick look at the uh, greenhouses. I emptied a lot of them off screen. You see they're at 82%. 82%. I bet the strawberry ones are 100 now, aren't they? What I might do is just wait for them to catch up. That's 40%. Yeah, so they're at forty uh, percent. Let's check these guys out over here. I bet you they're hundred percent. Oh no, sixty-nine percent. Sixty-nine dudes. Let's come have a look at the old lettuce greenhouse. Oh, it looks like it's um, working away again now. So this is what it looks like when it's working. Obviously, the lettuce comes out of here. The growing facilities in there. I'll quickly show you what's on the other side of this wall if you've never seen it before. Again, the uh, mod descriptions in my uh, my uh, uh, Volks Home mod map review or showcase, I should say. Yeah, so what it does is it obviously takes off the leaves and that and sp shoots them up the old spout there. So jobs are good and so to speak thing is once it becomes full in fact that's another thing I need to have a look at while well, I've got them, oh you're done no you're not done, you're not done you're far from done I know this is a tricky field this one what it does is it lulls you into a tricky sense of well, a full sense of security and you think you're done and you're not, you've got this little bit up here You can finish off on that one. You're going great on that one. It's good to see. Right, where is the front loader gone? Sorry again, skipping for all the vehicles. There we go. Yep, that looks full to me. So let's jump out and have a look at it. Quick look at it. See what the statistics are. Yep, the uh, board is full. The wood chips are getting quite full as well. So I might just quickly uh, come down here and uh, empty them out. Whoops. Looks like I'm gonna have to go to the front loading school as get ooh, well front loading driving school as well. I 
Yikes. Yep. Definitely need to go to the front loading driving school. Come on, get your act together, Kev. That's it. Under the under the pallet. You've done this hundreds of times before, you should be able to good be good at this. By now. There we go. So it starts that back off again. got to sell this surplus wood, it's sitting here, ready to be sold. Move those forks up a little bit, I don't want to get snagged up on the ground or anything. Park you back up over here. We'll go back to this and uh, take this back down to the main farm. I wonder if I can get away with putting all the wood chips in this in these trailers. It's a bit of an experiment going on here. Let's uh, see how much I can get away with uh, putting in here, or do I have to do two runs? Let's go and have a look. Again, I'm going a bit quick, so I'll let off the gas, let her roll down the hill a bit naturally. Be uh, a bit laggier than normal today. Even on this side of the farm, the frame rates are a bit lower than usual. I don't know what that's all about. I don't want to overtake this dude because he's going way too slow. Yikes! Yikes, wrong button. One of these days, I will learn to drive a tractor. Right, where was we going? Oh, the wood chip plant. That's right. Just here. Also another thing I will tell say to you, if anyone's got these, sometimes it glitches out and they don't actually allow you to hook them up straight away. One thing I've found, if you make sure you actually lower them before putting them back down on the ground, or de detaching them I should say, then 9 times out of 10 they kind of work, sometimes they sort of sometimes glitch out and don't work. Move the cover, 
extend. Go mad and drive straight into the bar of Bullshit. Looks like we might get away with this. Yeah, it looks like we might get away with this. What we do is then just dump off whatever wood chips we've just got back into it it needs them if not they're going back to the uh, yeah it definitely needs them so we'll go and put the rest of these wood chips back in the fertiliser and seed preparation Bye bye Mr. Golf. Tractor beating golf. Good morning. Never thought to see the day. We've got the slow pickup up here as well. It's a stack over him. Squeeze through there. Yep, we can. I should really turn in a bit later, that way I don't have to worry about going around the brewery. This is going to be difficult with two trailers. I'm hoping I can just get away with just curbing this. Yes. And that's now full, which is good news. So let's go and stick the rest of these in our uh, silo for wood chips. Um, try again, Kev. That's it. Again, it gets a bit laggy down here. Again, very sorry about that. Oh, he looks done. Alright, okay, he's done, so we'll move him down to the other farm. The other field, I should say. Laggy, laggy, laggy. I'm getting annoyed with it myself, so we can only apologise about it again. Um, it's a work in progress, so.
wonder how many eggs I've got in my backpack. That's one thing I'm going to have a look at in a second. Can we unload? Yes, we can. Unload, says me. There wasn't much left in those trailers. I think rather than do be stupid and cut that corner like I thought about doing, I'm going to actually spin around and do it pro. There we go. That's one of the lessons I learnt in the previous tractor driving schools. here <coughs> excuse me sorry about that right. <coughs> always get it whenever on final day long as soon as I go to do a, some gameplay recording wallop frog in my throat straight away right, okay park you back up and we're fine actually we better park you back up as well raise you back up you back up and fold you back up and drop you off and put your weight back on because I know for a fact if you don't have a good weight on this when you try to pick up those pallets it um, really goes mad there we go so shut you off we'll find that tractor there go again. So it's toggle light but I don't really need the light on, it's not that dark, it's early in the morning, it's not that dark. like he's more or less done on that field as well so we'll start this guy off on this field just a little bit there but Never mind. Only a teeny tiny bit. Jump out the tractor. Don't stop on my account, Mr. Tractor Driver. We're uh, lagging. Sorry. There we go. That sorts that out. 
crash straight into the back of the cedar. The tractor. Don't stop on my account, please don't. Mm. Off he goes, happy little bunny. Anyway, guys, I'll leave it at this. Um, thank you for taking the time and watching. Um, if you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And uh, I hope you have a good day. Ta-ta for now.